A Sea World trainer is recovering today after a terrifying ordeal in front of a horrified audience. For some reason, the whale just uh, took a different approach to what what it was going to do with uh, a very senior, very experienced trainer, Ken Peters, and dragged him to the bottom of the pool and held him in the bottom. Let him go, picked him up, took him down again. And these periods he was taken down were, were pretty close to the mark. Minute, minute 20. When he was at the surface, he didn't panic, he didn't thrash, he didn't scream. Maybe he's just uh, built that way, but he, uh, he stroked the whale. And the whale let go of one foot and grabbed the other. That's a pretty deep pool, and he took him right down. I think, I think that's to two atmospheres of pressure. Apparently, Mr. Peters is an experienced scuba diver, and I think that knowledge probably contributed to how he was able to be hauled down there that quickly and stay calm and know what to do. He knew what he was doing, because when you can see him actually in the film, it's the depth is so good, you can see him ventilating. You can see him ventilating really hard. So he knows about swimming and diving and being underwater. He may have been assuming he was going under again. I did not walk away unimpressed by his, uh, his calm demeanor during that whole affair. I would be scared shitless. to the end. Presumably, Ken Peters had a relationship with this whale. Maybe he did. Maybe that's what saved him, but Peters got the whale to let him go, and they strung a net across. And Ken Peters pulled himself over the float line and swam like a demon to a slide out because the whale was coming right behind him. The whale jumped over and came right after him. He tried to stand up and run. Of course, his feet were damaged. I mean, he just fell and he, he scrambled. And they take this as a prime example of their training working. And, you know, they say, well, you know, they stand back and stay calm, and that did work. They claim this is a as a a victory of how they do business. And maybe so, but it can also be interpreted as a hair's breadth away from another fatality. <laughs>